Everybody is talking about innovation. It's the newest buzzword for business, finance, and technology. But there's a big problem. For all the talk about how crucial innovation is to growth and success, no one seems to be able to agree on what it is and how to do it. I'm Matt Reiner. This video will tell you how to transform innovation from a buzzword into something you can do that delivers value to your clients, your firm, and to you. So stay with me to the end of the video. I promise it'll be worth it. Do you remember the slogan for Sara Lee Bakeries? Everybody doesn't like something, but nobody doesn't like Sara Lee. It's the same with innovation. Everybody likes the idea, thinks we need a lot more of it, but no one really understands it. So let's agree on something here for this video. Innovation is how we consistently bring value to our clients' business or lives and to our business. There's a big difference between creativity, invention, and innovation. Creativity is thinking of something new. Invention is building something new. Innovation is using things in new, valuable ways. It's pretty easy to see the impact of innovation in our industry. For most of the 20th century, investing was only for the very wealthy. When my dad started out in the business, there wasn't any finance.yahoo.com or Google Finance. You had to call your custodian or read the newspaper to see how the stock market did. You would go to the financial section of the paper and find your holdings to see the closing price from the day before. To get information on client portfolios, you had to call the service team. To make trades, you had to call the service desk and you were charged $50 a trade. Then Charles Schwab and Vanguard came along in the 1970s and opened the door to the masses. More of the middle class had low cost ways to invest. E-Trade opened in the 1990s and created a generation of do-it-yourself investors. And then the robo-advisors appeared about 2006 and millennials are letting robots handle their investing. You can see that new technology is putting change in turbo. Innovation is exponential. Our way of doing business today isn't going to be our way of doing business tomorrow. So let's start figuring out how to use innovation. There are two types of innovation that are most important to us. Innovation that impacts how we do business with clients, and there is innovation that impacts how clients do business with us. As an industry, we are great at analyzing other people's business, but we're not as good when it comes to running our own. We tend to look at it more as a lifestyle where we have relationships with people who have money. Too often we don't look at what has to change to make a one to three person firm run like a business. The challenge is the competition is beginning to run their firms like a business. The big phrase in corporate America is innovate, or die. It's that important. Innovating means investing in technology and infrastructure and making decisions on process management that allows them to be efficient, profitable, and able to grow. Sometimes this scares us because we don't believe we can run a quote, real business while continuing to have the extremely personal relationships with clients. Remember, all those relationships are built on trust and performance. You have to be more valuable and responsive than any information or advice they can find online. As advisors, we must provide clear value to our clients and deliver more of it consistently. We all have a loyal book of clients and it has created a great career for us. But if you want to develop a long-standing business that will take care of you and your family while you're working and after you stop working, then you must take time to work on the business. This means stepping out from the everyday routine and taking a look at how it works and where you want it to go. You need an innovation plan. What innovation does your business need? Where do you wanna be five years, three years, and one year from now? What are the growth opportunities? What are the areas that are frustrating? What technology can give you the innovation to reach your goals and objectives what innovation do your clients need? How are your clients' needs changing? And how can you get ahead and stay ahead of them? 
what technology can help deliver the innovation they need to achieve their goals and objectives, and how can you become more valuable every year? Remember, innovation takes time, thought, and some soul searching. It requires change. Innovation isn't doing the same old things just a little bit better. I have some specific ideas for you in the next videos, and I'll show you how you can use communications, process management, and technology to drive innovation. If you like these videos and wanna know when we post new ones, please subscribe. There's a button down at the bottom. And if you subscribe, I'll send you exclusive content that you'll only get as a subscriber. I'm doing this because I want to change how we talk, listen, understand, and serve our clients. Follow me and I'm gonna help you view money and financial management differently from anyone else. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.